know Bulverde Road, you know that sometimes it's a struggle to get to where you need to go. And driving down a long stretch like this can also make it easy to get distracted. We want people to keep their eyes on the road, obviously, because it's just really annoying when it's a green light and someone's just on their phone and you're just sitting behind them. You're just like, are you going to go? So students at Johnson High School decided to do something about it, forming the Johnson Smart Driving Club in 2012 with parent volunteer Melinda Cox at the helm. The Johnson PTSA Smart Driving Club works on campus. We work in the community. We work with uh, community members, safety organizations, TxDOT, SAPD, hospitals, pretty much anywhere we can in order to get out a safe driving message. 17 year old Ethan Waters is one of the students in the club. He decided to join during his sophomore year after he got his driver's license. I personally didn't want to drive distracted because you know it's tempting when you have your phone right there and I also wanted to make a difference in the community because that's like a problem I noticed personally was seen so many people on their phones. It's against the law to text and drive. The students meet after school with Ms. Cox to develop new ways to help break the culture of distracted driving. When you're behind the wheel, the only thing that you should be doing is driving and you should be paying attention and keeping your eyes on the road and not on the phone. Um, it can happen in a second. A text can wait, right, and your life can. So if someone texts you, hey, you're on your way, you can, they're going to assume you're on your way if you're driving. So. Yeah, your life, you only get one shot at life. And thanks to support from the Parent Teacher Student Association, administrators, parents, and teachers, their message is being heard. We've been able to start our program on the campus, but then we have reached out from everyone from Papa John's all the way up to the state capitol. I mean, we, our kids have been recognized on the house floor at the state capitol for their work that they've done in their communities and on their campus for safe driving. Ms. Cox says it's also a reflection of the kind of students that come out of Johnson. Johnson cares about its campus and its students and its staff. I have the daughter who graduated in 2014 and the most important lesson she took away, not only from my club, but of course from the campus, is that they have a voice and that they can stand up and be proud of the campus that they came from. Discover the NEISD way where our volunteers advocate for the students and the community around them.